Hello and welcome to this learning video. The purpose that I have taken an example on case number two again is that the students should not have any single doubt when they are solving the problems on rule number two. Okay, so why I am taking the example on rule number two again? Because this is in two, okay? And what student think in the examination like, okay, this is into, no, it was a printing mistake. This is actually plus and they solve this problem, but this is not the case. Okay, when you encounter such type of problems on case number two, then what you need to do is, as you can see, we just have to find out PI. So question demands only for PI, that is particular integral. So I'm going to write down the particular integral only okay so before I write particular integral I have to start with a given thing so the given PD is given PDE is can you write in the form of operator D and D dash yes so this is D square this is D D dash okay and this is operating on Z is equal to sin x into cos 2y okay so we have to find out its particular integral over here so what you are going to do is you just write down pi is equal to 1 upon d square minus d d dash into sin x into cos 2y okay now this is again I am telling you this is into this is not plus okay so don't bother uh, don't think like this is uh, just uh, plus and it is printing mistake nothing like that so if such is the case then what you need to do is multiply by 2 and divide by 2 okay and I will be taking this 1 by 2 outside okay and then it would be d squared minus d d dash into now this is like 2 sin a cos b so do you remember the formula for 2 sin a cos b so let me remind you of that formula so here i am writing 2 sin a into cos b so if you remember the formula just pause the video for a few seconds try to write down the formula for this and resume the video so i hope you might have written it so 2 sin a cos b is cos of not cos yeah sine of a plus b sine of a minus b because sine is appear plus so it is plus sine would be plus okay so this is a 2 sine a cos b equal to sine a plus b plus sine of a minus b so apply this formula over here and you can write sine of a plus b so x plus 2y minus sine of a minus b that is x minus 2y okay now this becomes very simple and you just need to separate this so this is 1 by 2 outside then it is 1 upon d squared minus d d dash into sine of x plus 2y minus 1 upon d square minus d d dash into sine of x minus 2y simple okay so let me rub this yeah so if such is the case then uh, you can continue this is uh, case 2 case 2 so you can uh, the same thing is for case 2 so you can find out directly it's what pi for case 1 and 2 so what you need to substitute put d square is equal to minus of a square so minus of 1 square is minus 1 and uh, then you have d d dash is equal to minus of 1 into minus of 1 into 2 for this and for this it would be minus of 1 into minus 2 okay so you can just uh, directly put there if you don't write it is not necessary to write such thing but just for the sake of understanding i am telling you so my pi is equal to what is it 1 by 2 put d square is equal to minus of a square so here it is 
minus 1. So it is like minus 1 minus of what is d into d dash 1 into 2. So this is minus already is there. Now this is minus 2 for d d dash. Okay. Into sine x plus 2y minus. Now for this, this is 1 upon what is d square? Coefficient of x is square. So this is minus 1 minus d d dash. So what is d d dash? This is d 1 d dash minus 2. So this is minus of 1 into minus, sorry, minus of minus. So this would be minus 2 into sine of x minus 2y. So it is just like d into d dash is equal to minus outside then it is like 1 into minus 2. So minus minus plus 2. Okay. Now just write down. This is 1 by 2. Now what is minus 1 plus 2 is plus 1. So this is sine of x plus 2y minus this is minus minus plus and this is minus. Okay. Minus minus plus minus minus 2 minus 1 minus 3 and this plus 3 1 by 3 sine of x minus 2y. So this completes the solution of sorry this is yeah. okay yeah 1 by 2 this okay. So this completes the particular integral for this given equation. So uh, the purpose of taking this problem is that you should not get confused. Uh, do as directed. Okay. Like the problem is given like this. So according to the problem you have to solve. Okay. So thank you for watching and try to solve problems based on such types. Okay. So thank you.